hey, I've got an extension here for you called Speak It. I think it's going to be great for your students that need a little bit of support in reading and might need a screen reader. Uh, they, if any of your students have visual impairment, this is great as well. And I've even got a little surprise for your students that speak another language and might need some extra support in understanding what a word is. So go ahead over to your Chrome Web Store and add Speak It. So once you've got the little green box here and you see your guy with the green shirt on and the yellow bubble above his head, let's head over to a website with some text on it. So I've got this blog loaded up and all your students need to do is highlight the text. They can two finger click with their trackpad or right click if they have a mouse. And then click speak it. Plus you can use pick collage to play pre-made games. All right, that's awesome for your kids that just need a little bit of extra support. But what about your students that speak another language? So go ahead and click on your green guy in the top right hand corner again. And now let's select Spanish. You'll also notice that you can change the gender of the person speaking, uh, how slow or fast they talk, so the speed, the pitch, and the volume as well. So I keep mine on normal and it just follows my volume slider set already. So now we've changed it to Spanish. So let's try this. If you have a student that's a uh, predominantly Spanish speaker, it maybe needs to hear a word pronounced in Spanish to then begin to understand what that is. So let's click speak it again. Plus you can use epic collab to play pre-made games. All right, so there you go. It'll take English words and pronounce them in Spanish for your students, and it'll take and be a screen reader for any of your students that need just a little bit of extra support. So check it out. Again, it's called Speak It, and it's an extension in the Chrome Web Store.